Er hat zwei European Tour Turniere in seiner Karriere gewinnen können. Eins davon in diesem Jahr bei den Danish Open in Kopenhagen ist natürlich ein weiterer Titel hinzukommen für Chizzy Dave Chisnell. Dave Fisnel tritt gegen den Weltranglisten ersten an. Der Mann steht bei Sage und Schreibe 32 European Tour Erfolgen. Vier Turniersiege gab es alleine in diesem Jahr 2019. Ladies and Gentlemen, er ist der aktuelle Weltmeister. MVG, Mighty Mike, Michael van Gerwen. Four men remain here at the European Darts match play in Mannheim. The man who won it, or won at this venue a couple of years ago, won this event last year. Michael Van Gerwen is one of them, the world number one, the world champion. And he probably couldn't wish for a better opponent in the semi-finals. Not because Dave Chisnell isn't any good, we know that he is very, very good. He's just seen off the world number two in a strange quarter-final clash to get here he's gonna to have to see off the world number one a man he hasn't beaten in his last 25 outings against him is there anything to suggest that that could change tonight Dan Dawson well one of those 25 outings was a draw so don't go thinking if defeats in a row Murph it's only 10 or then 40 defeats it is more than three years, three and a half years actually, since Dave Chisnell beat Michael Van Gerwen. That was a floor tournament that you have in qualifiers. Game on. But do not rule it out. In fact, the draw that they had in the Premier League, had Chizzy not missed a match dart, he would have been the only person other than Taylor and Van Gerwen to the Premier League standings at the least stage. But he missed it. It was a draw. Van Gerwen top 135. Uh, G almost didn't finish top of the Premier League this time around, did he? It was Rob Ross who was threatening to do so, but James Wade he helped Van Gerwen to the top of the table by defeating Cross in Leeds on the final night of league action. MVG went on to take the title. Yes, Michael found the whole situation ever so. Well, there is a, a £25,000 winner's bounty. 140. Brucey bonus for the world number one. And managed to earn it from the comfort of an armchair 51. in the hotel. Looking at ball or 25 to leave a finish, doesn't get it. So, cheers. Well, 1 on 140. And he should get it from there. Easy. Ah. 
wafty last one makes things a little trickier. Oh, treble 13. 123. Debut across 95. Choices for Chisnell. Choice. 79. What makes you say that? Well, you should have chosen to fight in the double 19. Then. Games from the As it is, he's just Michael lost Benjamin. it against the throw. And already Second Dave Chisnell hit that off. sinking feeling. 14 data for MVG. 100. Now the world number one is making a splash. The first 180 of the match is... 12th of the tournament he's also had three 24. scores of 170 something Fifty-eight. this a repeat of the inaugural final of the european darts match play back in 2015 that was in innsbruck in austria and the ski slopes of that part of the 100. world 100 Chizzy beaten by Van Gerwen in that final. Chizzy made the final again the following year when it moved to Hamburg. Wade beat him there. 140. The last seven meetings between the pair have all been on stage. And Chisnell got close on a couple of occasions. 7-7 when they met the Masters at the start of this year. One of three meetings this season. But 7-6 at the German Open in the final. Yeah, he had not there, didn't he? And couldn't get the job done. You do wonder how much of it is a mental block. Chizzy can make this close. If he can get an opportunity to win it, can he get over the line? At the minute, you're not even sure if he's going to get close. Because Van Gerwen is operating on a different level. That is a 13 data to back up the 14 data. And Michael Van Gerwen, having averaged 100 against Ratajski, 105 a bit against Suljevic, he is threatening to post a third consecutive ton plus average which over the last what, three months there's been a lot of talk about MVG not hitting the 100 mark in the averages for him to put three back to back on the Euro Tour might dispel any of those concerns that he is not playing his way back to full form well that's flown out of his hand all wrong and gone nearer the treble 12 than the treble 20. Yeah, it would have been a happy accident and it just... It'd be one edged. of yours, wouldn't it? All that right. minor 36 or a 54 when you're going for the 60. Yeah, cheers for that. 120. Well, I've not seen any of that for Dave Chisnell as yet, which is good news, because this weekend he's beaten Meikle, Rick Evans, Rob Cross, the world number two, and physics in the quarter-final. Although, I mean, they could have fallen on the floor and it would have Yeah, the dart that fell on the floor was almost 100. worth as much as the dart as the three <laughs> that Dave Chisholm put in the board. And going down to 146 after nine. 140. Could be 14, 13, 12. That won't be. 54. Well, Chisnell's going to have to pick it up pretty soon. Otherwise, the juggernaut that is Michael Van Gerwen Michael, you could 92. just start racing away with this match. Double 16. 14 data. Michael Van Gerwen averaging Top around the 110 mark right now. One hundred and fourteen rising. Did meet at the starts master well this year. Van Gerwen seeing off Chisnell six four in the quarterfinals. One hundred and twenty one. Didn't go to win that title, of course. He was beaten by Ian White in the decider. One hundred and forty five. Right, Van Gerwen is is playing in the manner here of a man who just knows he's got the beating of his opponent. 121. What is it? What is it about playing Dave Chinnell that gets Michael Van Gerwen going so? Well, I think there are a few things. One is that he's allowed to play at the rhythm he likes. You've seen him produce enormous 
displays against the likes of Chizzy, Michael Smith, Steve Beaton, because it's a very regular rhythm and he can just settle into this groove and play like this. Double nine. Oh, lining him upside. Look at the scoreboard. Oh, Chisnell is on a finish. Maybe he could get a leg off me against the throw as well. Simple equation now. Well, maybe he couldn't. 49. Michael, you require 18. Is he going three double three? He was thinking about it. Decided against it. 14. And it didn't matter anyway. 70. Missing doubles in clusters. Just the want a double top for Dave Chazel, and he's having to shuffle across to the left to find a, a route. 30. Michael, the dart in the single four. proved to hamper him too much. Takes an extra step back for focus there, Michael Van Gerwen. Michael Van Gerwen. It is four. Just to give you a guide, Dan, to how well Michael Van Gerwen generally plays against Dave Chisnell, mm. I mentioned that the last seven meetings have all been on the stage. Five of them he's averaged over 100. Three of them he's averaged over 105. Averaged over 109. Well, I, I think part of it is the rhythm, obviously. But I also think, 100. ironically, it's that he respects Dave. And he knows how good he is. Dave Chisnell is the man who took Michael Van Gerwen's record on the European Tour for the highest average in an individual game. Because he knows that Chizzy is one of the biggest, if not the biggest 180 hitter in the world. And he can, seriously, he can't just rock up and think, ah, oh, well, I'll, I'll, I'll beat this last, smash him off the board. But he's threatening to throw another of those 109 averages against him here. And unfortunately for Chizzy, he has not got going. 42. He, <laughs> yeah, Michael clearly frustrated with how much he's struggling in this match. <laughs> but th these are the games, I've seen it before, where he's so far ahead of his opponent, he's, then, he's racing against himself, isn't he? He's trying to produce perfection, isn't yeah. he? That's what he's, he's after. He wants to go and take that record back off Chizzy or Did something ridiculous, win it 7 with 120 average. Because he knows he can. Does stay there. Does stay there for double ten. Done by Dave Chisel. Chisel. Like Avoiding the prospect of a whitewash. It is a prospect that he has been on the wrong end of a couple of times before against this man. In fact, back to back defeats nil. One in a final in Shanghai. Eight nil. Yeah, Shanghai Darts Masters. Ninety six. World Series event. The calendar for the PDC year out tomorrow. I'm not sure if it'll include the World yeah. Series event. It will have all the Euro Tours and Pro Tours. Mm. Plenty of opportunities to see this man, Michael Van Gerwen, in action. And plenty of opportunities to see him win, as I should imagine. 56. Looking to win this particular title for a fourth time. It's only the fifth year it's been staged. 51. <laughs> OK, right. Van Gerwen has gone big Evan to leave 170. Well, we just alluded to it that he wants to do special things when he feels like he's invincible and can't possibly lose a match. So he's left it on purpose. And he almost took it out. You can see the grimace. Chizzy's not on a finish. He knows he's going to come get come back and have a couple of darts for 5-1, but he He's here to try and put on a show. Van Gerwen, he's basically decided, Chizzy's not at it tonight, 25. it's down to me to give these people a show. Game shot the sixth leg. Five Michael. one leg for the number one seed. Seventh leg, Dave, two, go first. I was thinking down to that PDC have got an entertaining feature on the YouTube channel. On and the YouTube channel, right, yeah. Go social on. media. Outlets, the <laughs> tour mates. Ah, yeah, yeah. 84. And one of the questions is bogey player and Dave Chisnell's version of that. He said Michael Van Gerwen. I think it's a fairly it's decent fair assessment. Yeah. But I think he's forgotten about the match that he won 25 games ago. 
because in that I'm certain that he answers that I beat him at the World Grand Prix back in 2013 and I haven't beaten him since. <laughs> I'm not sure if Dave Chesnell in that but in qualify, hit the winning double and everyone got his suitcase. <laughs> Just assumed he lost. Yeah. So he's certainly well aware of the dominance that Michael Van Gerwen has held over him for a sustained period of time. 100. Yeah, but he did, yeah, beat him at the World Grand Prix. Beat Taylor, of course, famously at the World Championship, and then spent a lot of time losing to Phil Taylor in quarterfinals. If you get put on the naughty list by MVG or Phil Taylor, then you can spend a long, long time on there. Can't you, Nico? Yes, he's nodding. Wants to stay in the 20s because a ton leaves him at two data. 100. Oh. Just hitting them from wherever he wants to on the hockey. What well, is in the kind of mood to go for a couple of bullseyes? We saw Gawin Price earlier on attempt three bullseyes on 150. At a silly time in the match. No messing about here from Van Gerwin. Method. He hasn't got the desired outcome. Well, he's got an option for two bullseyes if you can't find a way to that. Maybe it's the right one. 60. Michael, you require 10. Great guide. Doesn't really play. use it, but Michael does find the double five anyway. And this is now 6 1. Michael Van Gerwen trying for a 7 1 3 to can his winning streak against Dave Chisnell to make that 11 games. 98. And 20. Five wins and a draw from their last 26 meetings. Nice. 96 is some record. Pretty certain it's got to be the best standing record in darts. Well, when we've seen unbeaten runs from players, like uh, Peter Wright was up near 20 games, wasn't he, when he won the three titles and went to the match play. Michael Van Gerwen has gone on runs himself of, of round about 20 odd games, I think, is his best. A 26 game unbeaten run, except every single time you are 40. playing a guy in the top 16 and often in the top 10 in the world. And that's unreal. It is. Well, that hadn't happened much in this match, but it has happened. Yes. But not much in this match. Yeah, I don't it's... think he could blame that for the situation in which he finds himself currently. And Gerwin. Miles in a maximum. It is his fourth of this contest and leaves him on 100. And the end is nigh for Chizzy. Because if Van Gerwen can take this 100 out, he will Michael secure Lee third consecutive 100 average. Could still do it. Could still do it on double 14. 72. But misses outside. There is actually a, a 27 match unbeaten run. 83. In the record books. Michael Phil Taylor over Roland Scholten. Well, that is in danger at the minute because Michael Van Gerwen... Game has just brought his to 26 against Dave Michael Chisnell Van and in emphatic style as well. 100.25. It is a third consecutive ton plus average from the world's best player. And he makes the final of the European darts match play for the fourth time in his career. The three previous times he won the title. If he can beat James Wade or Joe Cullen later on, then he'll do it again. MVG unstoppable, certainly where Dave Chisnell's concerned. Es scheint irgendwie kein Weg vorbeizugeben für Dave Chisnell im Duell mit Michael van Gerven. Er steht, er steht im Finale. Ihn sehen wir also gleich wieder. MVG auf dem Weg zur Titelverteidigung. Und die PDC bitte darum, nach den Halbfinals keine Interviews zu führen.